So basically, I'm just having a little lie down before I go to work. Like, I'm feeling so bleh. Literally can't be fucked. I can't be fucked. I don't know, I'm a great believer of... If you don't want to do something, don't fucking do it. Don't fucking sit and complain about it. But I really need money, so... It's not I need money, I need weed, mate. There are many ways out of this situation, but... Yeah, I'm choosing to go to work, so... Yeah. But I'm still gonna fucking moan, because... It's a fucking piece of shit, mate. Like, it's literally, like... Don't get me wrong, I love my job. Like, I think my job is sick. Like, it suits my lifestyle, that's what I do it. But... It's just like... <clears throat> sometimes... It's just like... Not today, mate. I'm trying to list all the positive things about going to work. Point number one. Money for weed. Point number two. There fucking isn't one. Like, literally, you're going to be watching this video and thinking, what a dick. Because I'm, like, up and down, mate. Like, literally, I'm up and down. Like, fucking, I don't know. I'm not hypocritical. You just don't understand. Well, I'm not a people person, but then my job involves working with thousands of people. <laughs> oh my gosh, literally. Fucking hell, mate. I can't make this shout, but literally, I can't. Fucking, I polished my boots in my other video, as you saw. Fucking still nice, mate, because I haven't been to work since. <clears throat> the point is... I'm on shit street, yeah. Which means... Drunk people... I can't press pause. Fuck. Throwing up all over my fucking boots. It's really not the one, mate. Like, literally. You have to, uh, excuse me for my, uh, dodgy camera work and editing, but I'm stoned, and it's quite hard to vlog when you're stoned. So, yeah. I wouldn't mind going to work, yeah, if I had one of these, yeah? A bed, yeah? This fucking thing here. Mate, I wouldn't mind it at all. Like, literally, I'd be fucking... Cushy, mate. Like, fucking... Yes, mate. If I had one of them, just to go back to the room, when someone's being a fucking dick, I'd just fucking put my head on a pillow, mate, and just fucking sleep it off, mate. Fucking smoke a zoo. And I'm gonna fucking... Blaze up, mate. <laughs> <clears throat> ah, it's two jokes. <clears throat> I don't even know what's going on anymore. Like, literally, I don't. I don't know, like. Fucking. The fucking vibes are gone, mate. Like, mate, I feel like we're in a zombie apocalypse, mate. You know, when you don't know what, what, what you don't. I can't even fucking speak, mate. <clears throat> you know, when you don't know. You don't, when you don't quite know what is going on. Sorry, mate, but I had to get that out. But yeah, that's what I feel like. Just meh, what's going on, like. <sighs> fuck work. Fuck it. Literally, fuck. I'm done. Basically, I've just realised I've got some super duper shit from my dealer, like new stuff. So I'm going to roll myself a spliff, mate, and chill out. I'm trying to get myself in the right headspace, but it's not really working out. But then I've got a slight tension headache, mate. I need some food, like all these little things. That's just good. like, 
Oh my god, I tell you what though, man's gonna get some kings while he's out, right? Yeah! Because literally, rolling with fucking minis is fucking annoying, mate. Literally. I found half a pack of kings, yeah, and I fucking used them. But, like, it was so much nicer rolling with kings. It was so much easier because it's just, like, so big and you can just roll so perfectly and fucking. Yeah, it's just great. Like, literally, I'm. Need the kings, mate. Do you know I'm actually going to go and look for some kings, so BRB. So I've got no kings. As I said before. But obviously went to look for some. <sighs> Very disappointing. I rolled my zoo. Here it is, mate. It's looking a bit shabby, but... As long as it smokes. As long as it tokes. If it... What's the saying? If it's if it if it tokes, it smokes. If it's tokeable, so got my zoo, you know. And as the saying goes, if you can toke it, you can smoke it. Because obviously it's looking a bit shabby, but nevertheless, I'm gonna go out and enjoy this zoo, and uh, I'll probably take you along, but. Yeah, I'm just still in in a, in a phased mood, but hopefully this will sort me out, and we'll go from there. <laughs> Here we are outside. Yeah, mate, that's not too bad. Dog fucking it up as usual. Tasty, mate. <clears throat> I'd like to uh, take this time uh, to once again address my content and attitude slash personality. I don't agree with explaining because I think you should just be who you are, but I want to make it clear as to why I'm on a certain path. So, the point is, for anyone watching my videos, how can I put this, like, I just want to make videos, yeah, that are just about me, rather than making videos to provoke a reaction. For example, before I used to just make videos that were just, there were rants, and it was how I felt, but... I just said with my opinion and that was it like but I like to think I'm on like more of a chilled vibe so yeah that's why I just <laughs> do vlogs and shit like I have got videos actually recorded but I just need to edit them which are not like outrageously bad <laughs> basically what I'm saying is just get on board because this is it like <laughs> Like, this is the act. Like, get on board. <laughs> Basically, I'm just in a mood where I'm reflecting about my actions. Without getting aggressive, what I'm just saying is watch me because you want to. And because you like me. Not because you just want to fucking be a cunt. Smoking weed isn't just about being fucking lazy and getting high. It's a way of life, like... It's, I don't know how to explain it. It's more of a spiritual thing, like, opens your mind, mate. Like, it allows me to take a slower pace to life. And I look back and I think, fuck. A lot of things I did, which was just so long. But now I'm on a level mindset. I feel anyway. Not everyone will agree with this, obviously, but... Yeah, fuck them. I always get sketched out and nervous about work, like unnecessarily. Like, that may sound weird, but my job is one of those jobs you could, like, have an event and just, like, stand on a gate fucking checking wristbands for fucking 12 hours. Everything be fine. 
or chairs could go fucking flying, mate. <coughs> it could go either way, like, you know. But, yeah. It is what it is. And that's another thing because like like I just said, it is what it is. You just get on with it. So like I'm not actually nervous. I am, but then there's no reason for me to be because I know if there's something does happen you just get on with it. It doesn't really matter, but it's just like ugh like CBA. Like really CBA. <clears throat> so I'm back inside. It's five twenty. I've been smoking for an hour. I've still got my shades on indoors, I know. Um, I've gotten quite better, actually, because for anyone that knows me personally, then you'll know that I wear shades all the fucking time, day or night. <laughs> and if you didn't know that, then fucking get used to it. So I have an hour and a half until work. And, yeah. <laughs> Like, I don't know. I literally don't know how I should be feeling right now. Like, I really don't know. Like, ugh. So I'm at work. I'm by the pavilion. I'm at a screening. So there's the pavilion there, Brian Pavilion. I'm in the pavilion gardens, as you can see. It's a bit overcrowded, but I'm just filming now while it's still light. And it's gonna get busy later. Look, there's my gate. So I'm not letting anyone into the gardens. This is exit only, so yeah. Let the fuckery begin. So basically, I'm gonna have a debrief at the end of this, but I just wanna show you something quickly. Bro, I wanna show you this sign that clearly says exit only, okay? So you clearly see that right there, right? Right, okay. So when I do my video later on, I'm gonna have an extended video, because at the moment I'm just doing little snippets because I can't talk much, but yeah. Just wait and see, mate. So I'm back home. That's all the footage I got from work. I've got plenty to say. But I'm just cooking some food. Rolling a zoo quick. And then I can explain. What the fuck? has been going on tonight. I'm not in a very good mood. But I'm trying to get to my happy place. So. I don't know where to fucking begin, mate. <clears throat> like, literally, like, where do I start? So, I start by going, I got there, and I got put in the gardens on an exit, yeah? Which clearly said exit only, as you saw, right? Now, my job on this particular occasion is on a gate, which is obviously a coincidence, because I mentioned that as an example earlier. <coughs> the point is, I was on a gate, and it's only an exit only, because... Basically, it's one in, one out, and because it's a free event, like, you've got to account for the number of people that's on site. <clears throat> if you can't account for the number of people on site, then the, the event gets closed down by the council, and that's it. So, anyone who goes to a festival or an event and starts getting lippy with the security for the rules that are in place, thinking they're stupid, you won't have a fucking festival if the council shut it down. So, yeah, the point is, got to work in the back of these gardens. I'm stopping people from jumping over as well as on this gate. The amount of people I've fucking got coming up to me. Oh, can I come in this way? Oh, please, can I come in this way? You fucking saw the sign yourself. It clearly says exit only. Nothing else. Exit only. Next point I'll move on to. <clears throat> signing in. When you go into a shift, you've got to sign in so everyone knows you're there. If anything happens, they know to come and look for you. But me being me and Mr. Awkward, I don't really like signing in because I sign in and then everyone stands around chatting and I'm just standing there like, mm, yeah, okay. At which point I was 
could have gone for a zoo, but I didn't. And I don't know what I did. I'm only just thinking about it now. Shit. Fuck. Why didn't I do that? Moving on. Um, basically, <clears throat> people were jumping over and it got to a point where they was just like, right, okay, it doesn't matter. Like, just leave it. Which really fucking pisses me off. So basically, you've just got people jumping in and nobody gives a fuck because we've been told to let them in. Now this doesn't seem like anything, like listening to you guys listening, it probably doesn't seem like a lot, but it's a fucking piss take when you have to follow by rules. But the people who make the rules shit all over them. There is other things, but I'm going to leave it there. I don't want to dwell on the past too much, it's done. But I just wanted to give you a recap of how my day has been and how work was, because obviously I was filming most of the day, chilling, relaxing, and then... Yeah. Anyway. Got my zoot, mate. Life is chilled. Also, I met this guy. <clears throat> we'll call him Johnny Smith. Because I don't know his real name. Scratch that. It's irrelevant. You don't need to know. I'm so glad I smoke weed. <clears throat> Literally so glad. I... Life without weed makes so long. Like literally so long. I'm just getting into my happy place, mate. I like your breathing, mate. You breathe out, yeah. But what you want to be doing <clears throat> is you want to be imagining all your thoughts, yeah. All the thoughts that are clouded in your mind when you close your eyes and you can't concentrate. <clears throat> all those thoughts, yeah. You want to turn into white light or clouds if you need a visualization. Sounds stupid, but try it. Like white light, mate. Just imagine a white light. And it just slowly whiten out your thoughts, mate. Slowly, sheets of white just covering the thoughts. Try it, mate. It works, mate. Anyway. I'm not quite at Stinging Roger, but... Yeah, I'm going to go <clears throat> collect my thoughts. Stay blessed, mate. I can't press pause again. Shit. Shit. Fuck. As you can see, my editing skills are not on point. I told you I'm stoned. Allow me, mate. Allow me, please. I'm doing it again. I'm taking ages to sign off. Like I need to learn just to quickly sign off, mate. Right, okay, I'm going. <clears throat> Bye. See you later. Safe. Peace. One love.